Hello Dan Safarians and Dinosaurs. So today I'm going to show you guys my collection of whales, dolphins and some prehistoric marine reptiles and um, animals. Okay, so let's get started. First figure right here, it's actually a Mosasaurus. It is a prehistoric marine reptile. So all the prehistoric creatures will go on the left hand side, okay? Next up, is this a prehistoric creature? Nah, not really. This is actually a grey whale, which you can also find in modern day, okay? Modern days, I mean. Yeah, that's right. So all the whales and dolphins will go on the left hand side, okay? Next up, I have a prehistoric whale right over here. This is actually known as a Basilosaurus. So check out a name written right below. Basilosaurus, it is a prehistoric whale. Yes, it doesn't really look like the whales that you can find nowadays, but yes, this is a prehistoric whale. Gonna put this on the left hand side. Next up, this actually looks like a modern day great white shark, right? I mean, if you take a look at the face, if you take a look at the body, it actually looks like a great white shark. But this is actually a Megalodon, which is a prehistoric um, shark. It is very big. You know, the size of a great white shark when placed next to it is probably about this size. Yes, so it's like, you know, more than 100 times bigger than a modern day shark. Next up, Let's see what else we've got. We have an orca right over here, also known as a killer whale. I want you guys to answer this question down in the comment section below. It's an orca, a whale, or a dolphin. Okay, comment down below. All right, gonna put this on the right hand side. And let's move on. This is definitely 100% a dolphin, and in fact, it is a bottlenose dolphin, one of the most uh, commonly known um, species of dolphins, okay? Really intelligent um, animal. I'm gonna put this on the right hand side. Next up, we have another prehistoric marine reptile, and check this out. This is actually a Plesiosuchus a 2016 um, you know, figure that was added to my collection. So it's really nice. Put this right on the left hand side. And here we have another fish, but this is a Dunkelostis, a prehistoric armored fish. So you can see the entire body is like covered with armor. Very cool. Next, we have a Blaineville's Big Whale, a very interesting looking whale, okay? Right, put this on the right. What else we've got? Another whale, and this is a humpback whale. Yeah, I think this is very well known as well. Okay, gonna put this on the right, and let's take a look at another prehistoric marine reptile. I mean, this is actually another Mosasaurus. Mosasaurus is actually my most favorite prehistoric marine reptile. Yeah, what about you guys? Let me know down below. And the name actually means the Lizard of the Muse River. Next up, we have a Beluga Whale. It's Beluga Whale, a whale or dolphin. You guys know, please let me know down below as well. Right over here, we have a Vaquita Popoise. Yeah, they are they are critically endangered. I think there are like less than 10 left in the world. And here we have yet another Mosasaurus. This time, this time it is actually a um, blue Mosasaurus. All right, I'm gonna put this right over here. Another prehistoric marine reptile. And what is this? I can't really remember. So let's take a look. I don't think the name is written right below. So I think. This could be a Chronosaurus. Yep, that's right. Next up, another prehistoric um, sea creature right over here. This is actually yet another Dunkelosteus, the armored fish that was shown to you guys just now. Okay, we have another whale right here. And what type of whale is this? Let's find out. This is actually a blue whale. Yeah, I think this figure has been with me for like the longest time. What is this? This is actually a narwhal. All right, 
very interesting looking um, sea animal. It has this long spear right in front of its um, face. I, I assume that this spear is used as a hunt, hunting tool. Yep. What else we've got? Okay, right over here, we have another prehistoric uh, marine reptile, and this is known as a Tylosaurus. It looks a little bit like a Mosasaurus, okay? What else we've got? This is a sperm whale. You can see it has a very significant squarish face. Yep, square, squarish head, actually. Oops, gonna put this right on the right hand side. And not a huge wheel right over here, and this is known as the right wheel. Yes, R I G H T, the right wheel. I'm gonna put this right on the right hand side, right to where to be placed on the right hand side. We have another prehistoric fish, and this is known as a coelocanth. Yeah, I mean, you can actually find the name written right below coelocanth. Coelocanth. Yeah, that's right. A prehistoric fish. Another orca right over here. Okay, also known as the killer whale. Wow, what is this? I can't really remember the name of this prehistoric marine reptile. I think it's known as a dolly covering cops. Let's see. Yeah, that's right. The name is written right over here. Dolly covering cops. Not curry chops, but curry cops. All right, what else we've got? We have a Ganges River Dolphin. Yeah, not a really interesting looking dolphin. Very, very narrow uh, mouth or snout. Another really interesting um, sea animal right over here. This is actually known as a pygmy sperm whale. It is a small whale. It is about the size of a um, dolphin. Really interesting, right? Whale shark, they're not really huge as well. Um, probably like, you know, maybe the size of a shark, longer than a shark. Yeah, I've actually swam with them. Uh, they are filter feeders. They're not really dangerous to uh, humans. Another Mosasaurus figure right over here. This is from Schleich. Really love this color scheme a lot. Looks really beautiful. And this is another sperm whale. Yep, that's right. It comes with a fact card right over here. So let's see what is written on it. Sperm whales can dive deeper than 30,000 feet and hold their breath for 90 minutes. All right, that's pretty cool. Dunkelostis. This is an armored fish as well. Okay. Humpback whale that comes with a fact card. So let's take a look at what is written right over here. Hornbacks were once hunted extensively and they remain endangered. Yeah, so they are still endangered at a, this point of time. Another whale, this one looks like the blue whale, but it is actually known as the sea whale. Sea whale. Yeah. Let's see what is written right over here. Sea wheels consume on an average about a ton of food per day. What is this? This is a very adorable looking uh, wheel. It is a pilot wheel. Nice. And our last figure inside is actually the um, bow head wheel. Yeah, a pretty big wheel right over here. So, yep. Hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Please let me know down below which site do you guys prefer. Do you guys like marine reptiles more? Mar mar you know, prehistoric creatures more? Or do you guys like the, the dolphins and the whales? Let me know down below. And uh, yeah, stay tuned. I will be back with another video tomorrow. So stay tuned for that. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.